participants of this event. On one hand, we are very pleased that this event was brought uh, to an end successfully, despite all the organizational difficulties which such a huge event will have. On the other hand, we feel a bit sorry because from tomorrow we will not let you with us anymore. This World Championship proved to be not only a record-breaking event uh, for uh, group championships, but also a record-breaking event uh, for FIDE and all of its events. 1,400 athletes, all of you, all of us, by coming to our country, and participating here, 1,400 participants from 87 countries. It's an honor that uh, we will never forget. In a little while, we will begin the closing uh, the award of, uh, of the Cups and Medals of the Winners. We will also have a small cultural uh, dancing uh, program from the local culture club Pricolis uh, Osorios Barbaras. Before that, I do not want to be long, I want to thank the Porto Caras Grand Mission for uh, hosting us here, the Anna Moshe also for helping us in hosting all these delegations, the local authorities for supporting us morally, the police of the KDD providing us the necessary security for such a huge event. We thank all of you for participating. I would like all of you to take this opportunity to thank you for your participation in the World Youth Chess Club in 2010. When we first started to organize this event, we could never imagine that global interest in participation would reach such levels. We could never imagine the magnitude and the challenges we would go, would go to face. 1,400 participants for 87 countries, 2,500 people in general, we take into account the combined persons, coaches, and delegates.
11 days of uh, tough fights, but only on uh, about 700 chess boards. Now is the time to announce the winners. tournaments in December and January, some tough ones there, and probably a couple smaller ones before then. So, get ready for those, keep going. Grandmaster Nils Grandelius from yes. Sweden I took um, third place in the under-18 girls group. Yes. What were the expectations before the tournament, and what can you say about the tournament this Well, okay, I was fifth ranked, so I, of course I was hoping to win, I came here to win. There was nothing else, but uh, now after the tournament, I can I can say that I'm quite satisfied with uh, with the third place. After all, it's my best performance ever, even though I've been top rated for some time. So, so I'm I'm very satisfied now after the tournament. Izad Kanan from Azerbaijan is the new world youth uh, champion in the boys under 14. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, how was the tournament for you? It was uh, not easy because. Uh, because it, it, in this tournament we are playing very very many strong players. For example, we had even one G Grandmaster and four International Master. But I think um, I did the maximum for my for, to be a champion, world champion. Shivan, congratulations on winning your silver medal. Thank you. How tough was the tournament? Uh, it was very competitive. I mean. Um, it, it, like uh, many players who have not, I've never heard of before, have just played, uh, have played really well, and and uh, it's uh, like really a lot of upsets, and yeah, and I'm happy to have come second. Well, I started quite badly. I started with three out of five, but after that, I got five and a half out of six, and I made quite a comeback. So 
so uh, in the end, I'm quite happy. And uh, how was how tough was the last game? It was very tough because I had a game of about six hours and 115 moves, and I had to win. And in the end, I succeeded.